Hey guys, welcome back to our channel, Cock with the Moms. This is here today, and today I got a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. All right, super excited to show you what I found at my local Dollar Tree. You guys, Dollar Tree two thumbs up for the Christmas items this year. I think they're on point. Yes, and they're actually really pretty. I like the designs. I'm a sucker when it comes to that red truck and that camper. But anyway, let's get right into it. So the first thing that I love are these tins. These cookie tins are super cute. Um, I think these are my favorite um, designs of all. But um, yeah, I got the camper, of course. And this one's see-through. I did hold back because I was like, okay, three is enough, Lise. And then I got um, this one. And that one's see-through. And then I got this one. This one says Santa's House North Pole Airmail. You guys don't have to just put cookies in here. You can put anything you want in here. Gift. Super cute. And this one's a little smaller than this one. You guys can tell. They had all different sizes. All different designs, poinsettias. If you guys like poinsettias, the poinsettias are beautiful. Beautiful. The signs, um, I do like, it's an, I'm a big sucker when it comes to those signs, but this year I'm okay. It's like 50, 50, you know, but I'm on the hunt for that red truck and I live in New York and like the Western New York. And I've been to three Dollar Trees. Okay, been to three Dollar Trees, and everywhere I go, I ask them, "Do you guys have more of those red trucks?" And they're like, "Oh, some lady came in, and she took them all. She bought them all from three of my local Dollar Trees." Okay, I am looking for that red truck. I'm a sucker when it comes to that red truck and the camper. So yeah, I'm still trying to find it. <laughs> But anyway, I love these signs. They had three different designs. This one says Farm Fresh Christmas Trees. Super cute. I love it. Um, very farmhouse. This is like what's really in is this type of decor. Not a fan of this sparkle right here. It does come off, but you know, it's fine. You can always paint it. I might just do that. Um, another thing are the ornaments. Now... I didn't really buy, sometimes I buy like a lot of ornaments. I love ornaments. That's another thing I'm a sucker of. I love ornaments, but you know what? Hobby Lobby has really nice ornaments. And I'd rather just spend like a dollar or two more for a nicer ornament. But anyway, um, I this one caught my eye. Now this, you could see this at Pier 1, Kirtland's, anything like this. This is a this looks very high end um, for Christmas, but anyway, for a dollar, I definitely bought multiple of these. If you guys are doing Elf on the Shelf, if you guys are doing anything like that, the Christmas um, p the what is it Christmas pajama Elf or something like that, um, this door. You can do a lot with it, even if you don't want to use it like that. I mean, you can, you can use it as an ornament, too. But you guys, think outside the box. All right. Um, I did find the red truck in these. The dish towel dashing through the snow. I love this. So cute. Um, it is the microfiber. I'm not a fan of microfiber, but it's cute. They had all... They had Three other different designs. Um, the picks. Okay, you know what? The floral is very on point as well this year. So on point. So I got this one, this set with the berries. Um, okay. Last year, I actually complained about these berries. Because they look so cheesy. This year, they're not as bad, okay? They're, they're like darker. You know, they're not like cheapy, but with the pine cone and this stuff, I love it. This one, is it different? No, it's the same. They're the same. So I got two of those. I actually thought they were different. And then these, I love these. 
They look like little icicles on there. They are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I actually bought multiple of these. This reminds me of Christmas, snowy Christmas, anything like that. Um, Christmas socks. Wait, look how cute these are. Oh my goodness, these are so cute with the penguins. And then I got this one with the dog and the cat. How cute. They had all different ones. They actually had more girl designs too. So if you guys have girls out there, little girls, definitely. Or you can buy some for yourself. I might do that too. And then I got this garland. Um, this is really new. Berry garland, nine, nine feet for a dollar. You can do a lot of DIYs with this. So um, if you guys are crafters like I am, definitely. Um, they actually have um, dish towels. Or not dish towels, bath towels. That have the red truck on them. If you guys hear that barking, something's going on next door. But anyway, um, look at the red truck. Oh my goodness. This They had the last two. I snagged them. I wanted these. These are so cute. They had two other designs. I think one was like poinsettia and the other one was, oh, I don't remember. But hello, red truck. Definitely, definitely. And then I saw these. These are the wall art stickers. I actually never buy the wall art stickers. But you guys, if you guys are planners out there or even DIY scrapbookers, use these. Use these. If you guys can see that, look. There's the camper. There's the red truck. What is this? Oh, oh there's another camper. Oh, that's another camper right there. Oh, look at it. It's so cute. I love that. So keep your eyes out on these things. And then they actually had the other stickers as well, like the bigger stickers that you could put on your window. You can put them on your window, but you guys, scrapbook. Scrapbookers, use those because those will make, oh my goodness, those will make any, um, anything make really pretty. Um, the, the candles, they're okay this year. Um, I only picked up one. It says everything home, the candle collection. This reminds me of a sweater, so I picked up that. Um, it smells good. I don't think it's going to be a good throw. So, but I thought that was really cute for $8. And you guys, look at this. Look at this. They had a Christmas tree. They had a star. And it's just a little pillow. You know, I did buy this for my boys because I don't know why, but they like this stuff they like to like write letters in it so that was really cool for them all right so besides the oh yeah i did forget i'm a sucker when it comes to the christmas bags yes i'm a big sucker that's my that's my thing look how beautiful this is merry christmas now you guys don't use this as bag i always say that i always say that frame them. I frame all my, almost all of these. And I just take my other pictures off and I put all Christmas pictures up, you know, and it makes my house look really nice. Super, super nice. It doesn't look like cheesy Christmas. Oh my goodness. This is beautiful. I love that. Oh my goodness. Because I'll tell you this, Going to Hobby Lobby, even Hobby Lobby. I love Hobby Lobby or um, the home goods store. And they have pictures that are Christmas pictures. They're expensive. They can be $8.99 and up to $20, maybe a little bit more than that. I will not pay that. I will only pay two bucks because I can frame this. Look at that. Or with the Dollar Tree frame, a little scissors, measure it. Cute. And then the tree. Very farmhouse. I love this. This is these are these two are actually one of my favorite, favorite, favorite bags of all. Um, the one thing I would say I wish the happy holidays was not so shiny. That's just me. I wish it was more matte finish. But you guys, these are beautiful. And then these, look at the red truck. 
These are like the little um, decal sticker things you put on the windows. I love these. Super cute. They come out with these every single year. Um, just different um, designs. And then these are these are brand new. Now, Nicole already hauled one of these. Um, so I got this one, Dashing Through the Snow, Red Truck. How stinking cute is this? What am I going to do with it? I have no idea, but I'll tell you this. For a dollar, for a nice bin like this, I'll take it. And then Farm Fresh Christmas Trees. Love that. And you guys, you can always put a gift in here. Put a gift in here. You know, besides like a basket, use this. How cute, right? And then last Christmas item is the ribbon. Now, I've already hauled some Christmas ribbon a while ago. I never seen the sparkly one, so I had to get red and white. Cute. Love that. They had like blue, they had green, um, they had gold too. All right. So, oh yeah, I did get these, these stencils. They had three different designs. So Santa stops here. Love that. Oh, it says, please Santa stop here. Okay. All right. So anyway, I picked up a couple toys for my kids, you know, for Christmas. Um, they love stickers. So I did get them these. These are great for like potty charts, like stuff like that. So I did get Timon, Pumbaa, you know, Lion King and Toy Story. And Toy Story actually has all the characters on here. Every single one of them. And it's Toy, Toy Story 4 with Forky. And then I picked up this book, 101 Dalmatians. I actually do not have a 101 Dalmatian book, which I'm like a Disney fanatic. But um, we are going to Disney, so I want to read this to my kids before we go. Um, I love the notebooks. I am, an, I am a notebook freak. I am a pa pa paper and pen type of girl. And I'll tell you this, I've never seen notebooks for guys or boys or anything like that. They're always very, very girly. Now I seen them and they actually had two other designs besides this one. Aiden, Aiden's starting to write things down and like um, put stickers and, you know, draw pictures. So I did get him this. I thought this was really cool. It just has lined paper, nothing too um, shabby, but, um, it's by Jot. So if you guys have boys out there, I would just grab something like this. I actually like to put this in the car and my kids just like to draw. They love to draw. Um, another, well, another thing is the games. I did pick up this game. I did play it with my kids. This one is the penguin, like break the ice kind of a game. I like it. It's cute. It's for a dollar, you know, um, my kids actually had a hit with doing it. They need a little help putting it together, but you know, my, um, my little boy is six. So even it says four plus my six year old need a little help putting it together. So, and then I came across these star Wars guys, um, sticker activity. Um, it has scenes. If you guys are a Star Wars, I am not a Star Wars fan. Even though I'm a Disney fanatic, I don't know a lot about Star Wars. But look at all these stickers. My uh, six-year-old loves Star Wars. Absolutely loves Star Wars. So he he's teaching me, teaching me about a lot of things, you know. But um, something like this is pretty cool for like Christmas. And then this one, these stickers. And it's a little bit different. This one has activities. And he's into the activity books and stuff like that. So, yeah. Especially, um, if you guys, we do, um, oh my goodness, I forget. But it's for the school and it's for, um, parents out there that can't afford Christmas gifts. So we actually donate a couple things for them. So this is great. This is great for donation items, especially near Christmas. And that's why I'm saying, keep your eyes open at the Dollar Tree because you just never know what you're going to find. And then, um, last but not least, I actually came across these. 
um, I'm going to like a little sprinkle. If you guys know what a sprinkle is, it's actually it's for a somebody who is having like a second or third baby or whatever, and it's a different sex. So she's having a boy. I thought these were cute. I love these things. Um, they're actually made very well. So this right here, I think this brand is from Walmart. I'm pretty sure. Um, so keep your eyes on these. These actually work. I've hauled these um, pink ones before from another um, shower I had to go to and she loves them. So and I actually told her, I'm like, I got a Dollar Tree because she didn't want it more. So she actually went to go grab more, but I did grab these for the other one. So I thought these were really nice. And yeah, guys, that's it for my Dollar Tree haul. Thanks for watching. And if you guys like Dollar Trees, give me a thumbs up. And if you didn't subscribe, what are you waiting for? Subscribe because we got a lot more Dollar Trees on your way. And we'll see you in our next one. Bye, guys. You take care, okay? Bye.